uh, Sinitian. So we're live just so everything. It's possible, but like even I know somebody who had him 40 spots lower. Like so, I'm really I it, it's an incomplete for me on him. The other two um, like Dobrol I had as a as a second rounder. I did early, very early, but it's still a second. The Penguins announced the signing of Russian winger Sergei Plotnikov to a one-year entry-level deal. I think that's the villain from SpongeBob. I don't think that's a person. <laughs> here's, here's, here's who I would ask for for Keith Yandel from the uh, Bruins. I would take Marshawn, Ryan, Ryan Fitzgerald, and a second rounder next year. Dream. I don't think I just don't think the Bruins would move would move uh, Brad Marchand right now. It just they're so thin on the left side as is, and I think you know for as as much criticism as he gets for the style of play that he that he does come with, which at times is a bit annoying for a coach. Uh, I just think that he's such a strong uh, yeah, presence happens. along alongside Bergeron. It's just they love that one two punch they have there, especially now with 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 Krejci and Lucic gone. Or is still there, but that connection's gone. They lost the connection with Soderberg and Erickson. Bergeron and Marchand's going to be their one-two punch now, and maybe I, this I don't is, know if anything could pry could pry them away from that. Maybe this is the Riley Smith move. No way, the Rangers aren't taking Riley Smith. You sure he's 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 <laughs> Riley? His I'm, name sure. Is I'm sure. What is this Carmax now? Come on. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's uh, Riley Smith is a player that. I the Bruins believe in, I but I think they'd move him at the same time. Uh, it's one of those situations. Not I would a think that, player, but but he's not going to help him now. No, I, I do think you could get someone like Marshawn if the Bruins believe that Char is slipping and they need someone on the power play, and you just got rid of Hamilton. Like who's your top power play guy? Yeah, no, it's true. I mean. Uh, right now, their point. I mean, they're probably going to go with. Krug and Char. The unit will be Krug, and I would have to guess opposite him uh, would probably be either Krejci. They put him back on the point sometimes. It could be Bergeron as well. Um, but Trotman is a guy they like up quite a bit. He played well with Char at the end of the year. Colin Miller, uh, the guy they got from the Kings in the Lucci trade, they really like him a lot. He had 19 goals last year in the AHL as a defenseman. Um, a lot of people believe he can just slide right in and be that power play guy there. So they do, they do have some options. Uh, but but for the Boston Bruins, the biggest need, in my opinion, they need a right shot defenseman. They can put they they can and they have put Seidenberg on the right side, despite the fact that he's a lefty. But right, right now, uh, their right handed defensemen are Kevin Miller, uh, Zach Trotman, and Adam McQuaid. I just think they want a bit more oomph back there, especially on that side. So. That's going to be the big thing for, for the Boston Bruins, and that's why I believe they're in on Mike Green. It's just that would make sense for them. Um, but, I mean, yeah, like we've talked about, I think Yandel would welcome a change, would welcome a return to Boston, you know, his hometown, of course. Yeah. Um, but it all comes back to the price and whether the Rangers want to, want to deal him to the Bruins and whether they can get a return that's – that fits what they want to do because the Rangers are a faster skating team and the Bruins are not a fast organization, so that's a right, problem. Right, right. right. And the Rangers had trying to beat the Bruins before, as you know. Yeah. Fight, fight, fight. So. Carolina, Carolina, Carolina. Carol, sorry. sorry. No, go ahead. Go. Carolina signs right winger TJ Hensick. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, this is the part of Return of the Jedi where you fall down into that pit. <laughs> It's, can you start playing Closing Time? Do you have that song? Yeah, I got it. I got it ready. I got it ready to go. I'm going to do the Tom Waits version, though, because that's by far oh, Jesus. the best version. Oh, I got Gaslight Anthem tickets in Lancaster on the 22nd of July. There you nice. go. So, nice. Chameleon. Now you just have to go buy your drink, whatever you're, that you're still out of. <laughs> oh, I got it. I picked up Take a Boost yesterday. A bunch of it. <laughs> I was in Jersey, and I got, I got a bunch of it yesterday, and... Um, my wife thinks I'm like insane for buying it because I it's it's but it's amazingly good. How and actually, how many gallons did you get? I got two of the gallons, which makes about forty five pitchers of it. Because <laughs> it really it's really diluted. Of that of that 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 concoction. Oh yeah, 
Oh my God! You're gonna be it's, dead, Eck. Well, you know, I know it's 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 not legal anywhere but the two counties in New Jersey where it was discovered. So I think I'd have I think I'd have a better a, a better life expectancy, Russ, if I went to you went to Europe and bought some absinthe. Maybe, yeah. maybe. Yeah, no, it's really something. Um, but um, I think we're gonna call the show in a l little bit here. Um, because this has been a, it's been but it's been awesome, and, and I've got so much more work to do. We aren't done at all by any stretch of the imagination. So stay on Hockey Buzz here. Um. Because yeah, we have. Stuff happening. Oh yeah, and I'm I'm getting more and more stuff. Come on, Richard Panic just signed a one year or excuse me, Panic just signed a one year deal with Toronto. Panic at the disco, baby. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fake rumor out there, of course, that you know Tarasenko's been offered up for Shattenkirk. That's not the case. No, no, <laughs> Tarasenko and Shattenkirk. <laughs> They're at the same team. I know, no, no. There's something involving Tarasenko on a fake rumor. That's what I was told. <laughs> yes. You're getting tired. It might have been offer sheeted. I am tired. I've got to. I've got to focus on. I. I. The Adderall's run out. I got to focus on the one thing. <laughs> I got to go focus on the on the on the trades. Um, it's been a great show, and it's really been. I mean, I think one of the more entertaining um, UFA days we've ever shows we've ever done for sure. Yeah, there's definitely been a lot. Yeah, no question, and. Um, you know, and and yeah, Ty just is cracking me up too much. That's, that was awesome. And uh, so we're so we got so thanks thanks to Ty, thanks to Russ, thanks to Dan, thanks to uh, Mike of of course as always. And uh, we'll be back tomorrow to talk about more of this stuff. Um, and we'll have more stuff going on for sure. We're not done by a long shot. There's a lot of trades still coming here. There's a lot of free agents still to be signed. Um, and uh, yeah, so please stay tuned on Hockey Buzz. Check out the rumor. The rumor tracker is going to stay up as long as the rumors are hitting hot and furious like they are now. And um, we'll be breaking stuff all night. And if something big happens, you know, I couldn't even. I, I was going to have you on again, Ty, but I just couldn't do it to you. I couldn't do it. I was thinking about it at the, at the draft. I was like, yeah, uh, I was an angry human that night. That's probably what <laughs> I figured. You were. I figured it was it's bad. like Kessel, Sagan, Hamilton. We can't have nice things. So <laughs> that's where I was at. So <laughs> that was perfect. You want everyone to see a 23 year old cry on on uh, camera? Yeah, couldn't have had me on that night. It would have been great. <laughs> well, all I can all I can say is uh, to to wrap things up that Leafs Nation is very happy today. This gives us a good solid three weeks to do to talk about Dion Phaneuf. So excellent. <laughs> it never ends. No, no, it never will either. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, guys, without the buzz, it is just hockey, and that's all right. Talk to you soon.